your bed has always been waiting for you. There we go. Looks lovely, Rick. It really ties it together. What does the artist in residence think? Um, it's definitely an abstract. I'm just, I'm not sure it really fits. We thought a little redecorating wouldn't hurt. We've been doing the whole house. I notice. It's okay, I can take it down. No, leave it. Allison, your father worked very hard on this. Really? Sorry. I'll leave it. We just want you to be comfortable. I just, I never quite know what's going on up there. Hopefully we can start making up for last time. I'd like that. Well, I'd say it's about beer o'clock, wouldn't you say so, Jane? Oh, they'll be here soon. Who? Ellie, has your father uh, shown you the bar downstairs? I think I just need to take some time for myself. Absolutely. We'll let you get settled. You've always got a tab down at right? <laughs>
going. Relax. Why can't you just enjoy the journey? Speak of the devil. And she shall appear. <laughs> <laughs> you remember Lisa and Jim from down the road? Yeah. You guys having a bit of a party? This is new. Well, you know what they say about an empty nest. Wait, what do they say? No, you're thinking when the cat's away, that's when the mice will play. Who are we? Are we the mice? I think Jane's had enough. Allison? Oh, no, no, oh, I'm fine. Thanks. Really? Oh, very mature of you. Where are you off to? Just hanging out with Mackenzie for a bit. I know it's my first night back. Oh, no, well, that's great. Tell her we all say hi. How's your arm doing? What? Oh, it's, it's fine. You know, we've got to ask. I got in a car accident. It, it, it could have been a lot worse. I just, I think it's gonna be a long, long time before I try to get behind the wheel again. The world's a little safer for it. No, that's too bad. I, I, I hope it gets better soon. We really do. Don't get too drunk. Well, it was really nice to see you guys again. I'm sure we'll be seeing you a lot. <laughs> so I got there. And do you fucking remember James Callahan? <laughs> so it's him and his stupid fucking, I don't know, gang or whatever. It was just surreal. I had to get the fuck out of there. Believe me, he made the right choice moving away. Or whatever. It sounds like nothing's changed. Believe me, it hasn't. And my parents, on the other hand? Are you okay? Yeah, they're just like, they're different. Like, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. But I think there's seriously something wrong. Like, they seem happier, but like, I'm worried. And I'm also worried that the longer I stay here, the more I could become... Like the rest of us? I didn't know. Oh, no, no, I mean it in a good way. You were always a little different. Special. You, for real. <laughs> Everyone else really admired you for following your passion, getting out. And yet somehow it ended up being like a return trip. I just I hated there so much. What does this say about me? It says that you've started philosophizing, so it's time I drove you home. You're nothing if not consistent. Thanks. Uh, I'll meet you out there. I'm just gonna get this. Hey, Allison. Shit. Oh, Rob, Neil, what's up? Heard you were back in town. Just, I'm just visiting, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. I heard you'd moved home. Couldn't hack it in the big city. Well, what you heard was wrong. Right? 
cool your tits. Listen, we're going to a field party later. Do you want to join us? I got better things to do. Oh, clearly. Like, getting wasted at the tavern alone. You're becoming a local already. Can I sign this? I really, I really have to go home. Come on. It'll be fun. Here they have a huge fire. Hey! Fuck off! What, you don't understand me? I said fuck off! Make it in the city, you can't make it here, so you drag me back in. Hey, at least I tried, okay? Like you're one to talk, still at the factory. Can we start again? I care about you, okay? And you need to know that whether it's me or your parents, we just want you to be the best you can be. Relax, just enjoy the journey. have been changed, Allison. We've come to understand so much this past year. Things we couldn't even conceive of have become crystal clear to us. What things, Mom? Jade, Richard, is she ready? Come, Ellie. You'll know soon enough. born of darkness and dust. The circle gave us life. The circle gives us life. What are they doing? The circle gives us life. The circle permits no creation but in its own image. What? What is the circle? The circle has made itself known to you. Without any prior initiation, you have heard its voice, its desires. And it has heard yours. So tonight was all part of the plan. It is so rare an occasion that a soul is born capable of completing the circle. I don't understand. But you do. You just haven't allowed yourself to yet. What you know is life. What you know is death. That is the circle. The earth is not our home. It's our hostage. Over time, man and his greed destroyed the circle. It must be rebuilt. One piece at a time. The circle alone creates. To join with it, you must destroy your own creations, as we all have. Like I said, a whole new beginning.
bloodline must be spilled together. Young flesh rebuilds the circle. Young flesh rebuilds the circle. Young flesh rebuilds the circle. You have an opportunity, Allison, to join with something greater than yourself, greater than flesh. But you must decide for yourself. From old life we are reborn, together with those who love you most. What? With those who love you most? You don't love me. Everything you did tonight was to get me here. You don't love me, you love the circle. Allison, you are, you are the, the circle. circle. I'm not. I've always loved you, no. Allison. No. You're lying. All my life. Stay away. Mackenzie! Let me show you. No. Stop. anymore.